I've got some Amazon wins that were $5. Let's see if they're worth the hype. Are they a hero or a zero? I'm Jamie, the crafty DIY guy. Welcome back to my channel. All right, you guys, there are all kinds of $5 finds on Amazon. They're all over TikTok. People are talking about them on Instagram. And I decided to buy 10 items myself, and we are going to test them, talk about them, and I'm going to share with you my thoughts on them. But before we get into that, I do, of course, want to say thank you to all of my subscribers. You guys know who you are. I truly appreciate you. If you are not currently a subscriber, definitely check the uh, subscribe button or hit the subscribe button and uh, stick around. Give this video a like, leave a comment, Comment below especially let me know if you are new to the channel and if you're still kind of on the crafty DIY guy fence check out the playlist there are lots of different videos on my channel as well lots of DIY projects shopping hauls and uh, product kind of DIYs and trying out things like we are doing with this first item this is called the angry mom this is a cute and clever design believe it or not this helps you clean your microwave. What you do is you take the wig or the hair off of mom. You fill it with a vinegar and water solution. You can also add like something like a lemon extract to it that makes it smell really, really good. And you put this in your microwave for a couple minutes and it actually steams inside of your microwave. And then what's so great about it is when you take this out of your microwave, you just simply wipe down the inside of it and you've got a clean smelling microwave. Kind of smells like vinegar. If you put a lot of lemon extract or a lot of lemon juice in your vinegar solution, it's going to help. But I definitely think that this is a hero. I do love this item. All right, my second item that we're going to be talking about today is this appliance cord keeper. Now, if you've not seen these on Amazon, you need to check these out because these are definitely a hero. This is a uh, sticky back here. This sticks onto your appliances and then you wrap your power cords around here. So let's say you've got a smaller kitchen like I do. If you need to put away maybe your toaster or your can opener and you're putting them up in a shelf or even down below, you know that sometimes those cords go everywhere. They are extremely aggravating. What this will do is this will allow you to wrap your cord all around it and what's really cool about this is that it rotates so if you need it to go up and down if you want it landscape or if you want it horizontal vertical horizontal it will do all of those things you get a four pack of these and I definitely recommend these I think that this is a total win a total hero in my book and I love these now, the next item we're going to talk about is this wrap around sink absorbent pad. What I do think is really cool about this is that it fits around your faucet and it does have a little channel here that kind of redirects water into your sink. So let's say you're putting a sponge or a drainer or anything like that on your countertops. This is going to help redirect the water because it does have these channels that kind of help direct water. However, my sink is not a undermount sink. So if you are thinking about getting this, make sure that you do have an undermount sink. Now, I would say that overall, the fit of this was perfect. If my sink was an undermount sink, this would have definitely been a good thing for me to have. And uh, even though it's not going to be exactly how I'm going to be use it, I think it looks really, really cool. I love the concept of it and I can still put my scrubbies and different things on it. So I'm going to give this one a kind of a half hero because it's not my sink's fault. It's my fault for not remembering that I didn't have an undermount sink. Now, another win that I definitely like, these are definitely heroes. This is a sample pack of some leak proof storage bags. These are replacing things like Tupperware and other containers. I'm still going to use those too. And what I really liked about this variety pack is that it gives you a couple quart sizes. You get a couple gallon sizes. I had that backwards. And then you also get some smaller kind of snack sizes that are definitely really good. What I loved about these two is that you can use these for travel. Anytime you're traveling and you want or you need something that is going to be leak proof, Definitely put it in these bags, use these when you're traveling and you will have leak proof or no spills, I guess, in any of your luggage. These are definitely a hero and I love these. 
Now, I know you've seen me haul these at Dollar Tree, but yes, it's true. The Dollar Tree ones just were not as strong. These, however, are extremely strong. You get a four pack of these, and these are hooks. These are car seat headrest hooks. So you hook these behind your car seat, you hang your bag on here, and they are extremely sturdy. I hung a leather and uh, kind of a canvas tote bag that I have, and it definitely held the weight. I only used one of these for my bag, and it held up really, really nicely. This is so such a great thing to put in your car. That way you don't have bags sliding all over the place when you're going shopping or if you need some place to securely put your purse. I definitely recommend these. These are car seat headrest hooks and these are definitely a hero. Refrigerator messes are no good and these refrigerator liners are amazing. I absolutely love these. They are the perfect size for my refrigerator and what's so great about them is that you get a lot of them for your money. These are fantastic. If you have any spills in your refrigerator, you can simply pull these out, rinse these off. They're made of silicone. They're gonna clean up really, really easily and they help keep your refrigerator nice and tidy in between some of those deep cleans. I know for me, I don't always clean out my, fridge, my refrigerator the way that I should. So these are definitely going to help me stay a little cleaner when I finally do stock my refrigerator because yes, I live like a bachelor as you can tell from my refrigerator that's just filled with booze and chicken salad and uh, beer. Now, when you see this little guy, you are not going to think this is anything. This is called a Dyna hook. And these came, I believe they were in an eight pack, maybe a 12 pack. Let me know in the comments below if I'm totally wrong. When they came, they were actually separated like this. And I was thinking to myself, what in the heck is this? This little hook screws onto this little magnet piece. And let me tell you, this is the strongest hook ever. This little magnetic hook supports up to 25 pounds of weight. I tested it out with a lot of different projects because or products because I'm going to use this in my craft room on my magnetic kind of pegboard that I have and it held up. It not only held hold well it holds a lot as you can see it's definitely holding a lot of weight and I was blown away by this. This is definitely a hero even though I can't talk. It's a hero. Now this next item is also a hook. It is stainless steel. It is also very, very durable. I took these hooks and actually put them on the inside of my closet in my craft room and used these to hang up all of my wreath forms and miscellaneous items that are kind of big or bulky that just don't kind of work in a traditional bin like the ones I've got behind me. And these are definitely a win. You get 10 pieces of these and you can pick them in a lot of different colors. I definitely love this and the adhesive as of right now has been very very strong so I feel like this is going to be a total total hero definitely check this one out all right you guys now we've been going really really good up until now but I have to tell you this unfortunately is going to be our first zero this is a linen hanging bag in concept it is super super cute it comes with this little wooden dowel it also comes with a piece of twine that you can tie onto this to hang up it's got these large pockets so you would think that this would be really really good but unfortunately for my needs it just was not great now the price point was perfect it was four dollars and ninety nine cents maybe it would work better for some smaller items but in my opinion there's too much space at the top here so this creates a kind of a heavier it kind of makes it a little top heavy there's not a lot of structure in this bag so it just doesn't hold the weight of anything substantial in here and everything that you put into these pockets seems to lean forward so for me this is a zero I did not like this one
Now, the last items I want to share with you are for those of you that maybe don't have a Cricut. These are fantastic labels. I love these labels. I think that they're so sophisticated looking. You're going to get a ton of them in the package and you can personalize little bottles like this that you may purchase at Dollar Tree. I bought both of these bottles at Dollar Tree for $1.25 each. And then the pumps were another $1.25 each. And with the labels that makes it so sophisticated looking and once my shampoo and my body wash refills finally get here. These will look absolutely fantastic in my bathroom. These are definitely worth the money and these are an absolute hero in my book. All right, you guys, let me know what you thought of my hero or zero list. I absolutely loved almost all of these products and think that they are going to be super useful for my home and for my craft room and my kitchen and all of the other rooms that I can kind of put these things in. If you have something that you would like me to test out, let me know in the comments below. If you have if you have found, I can't talk today because I'm so excited. I've had a lot of coffee. Uh, but if you have uh, found some other $5 must-haves or around that $5 price point, then obviously let me know in the comments below. By the way, all of these items were purchased before the Christmas holiday, so a lot of them were on sale. For the most part, I think everything is still in that $5 price range, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less. I obviously have no control over those price points that Amazon does, but if you can check them out, they are definitely worth it, except for, you know, that one product. All right, I'm Jamie, the Crafty DIY Guy. Thanks for sticking around. I'll chat with you later. Bye-bye.